I'm at peace with my thick body and I really need to all right, don't pan down. <laughs> so I need clothes, I need outfits. What's going on? Well, I'm not having a breakdown. <laughs> you know, it's not cute anyways. I was trying new things and it didn't work out, but I need to be more realistic about my curves. <laughs> oh my gosh. I had never seen you wear something so bright in my life. Okay, you guys, I'm very excited because today's video is sponsored by my favorite company ever, Litter Robot. And the Litter Robot 4 just came out and I could not be more excited because let me tell you, I literally tried Litter Robot when I was testing cat products three and a half years ago on my channel. I'm so happy. And it has changed my life forever. I had tried every litter box on the market. Oh, I was looking for a solution and with Litter Robot, you never have to scoop litter ever again. So let's unbox our new robot. This is Chio's first love, and as you can see, the white is the brand new Litter Robot 4. It's a Wi-Fi connected smart litter box. You also get a one year warranty, a 90 day in-home trial, and free shipping. All you do is lug her in, fill her to the litter line, and turn her on. Now what I love about this new Litter Robot is it's a million times more quiet. I literally wouldn't even hear it going has more odor control. Honestly, if somebody walked into my house, they wouldn't even know I had a cat because you're not gonna smell it because the litter robot knows when your cat goes to the bathroom and cleans itself right away. Cheeto took right to the first litter robot. It was never an issue. And getting the second one, he jumped right in. When you open the drawer, you can see that it self clumps, filters through, and then leaves Cheeto with a clean litter box every time. When I'm ready to change the box, I just take this out, replace it, and we're good to go. And all of you can order your Litter Robot today at litterrobot.com. And because they know I love the product so much, Whisker is conducting a giveaway for all of you. Two people have a chance to win the Litter Robot 4 for free. Just use the link in my description section below, follow a prompt, and Whisker will select two people at random by the end of the month. This is a brand new product, so it won't be shipping until the end of June, but it will be well worth your wait. Thank you, Litter Robot, for sponsoring today's video, and I hope you all enjoy. Hello everybody. Okay, today you're in for a big treat because Shane. This, this <laughs> what are you doing? This is my nipple shirt. You can see my nipples through it, so I'm just covering them. No, oh my gosh. I'm I don't keep you monetized, baby. Why do we not see girls' nipples, but boys' nipples are fine, aren't they? Well, my nipples are deformed, so. <laughs> My, my covering them is more just for you guys at home. Wait, are they really for real? You never noticed? No. Okay, I'll marry you. <laughs> Stop. Let me change it to something less nipply. I'm ready. I did get you that shirt, but well, Shane has a lot of big events coming up, you know, and he just started a podcast, so he needs to be looking fabulous and sickening and make the girly straws Jaws drop. Half of that was a lie. I don't know what he's talking about. <laughs> Big events, what do you mean? I don't know, we have no events to go to, but you do need to figure out like more than one look. I've been asking you to do this for so long and you always say no. Every time I've ever gone shopping with you, it ends in a big breakdown on your end and then I don't know how to manage the breakdown, so it's best for us to not go shopping together. Yes, but I've been to so much therapy now that like I'm at peace with my thick body and I really need to, all right, don't pan down. <laughs> I'm not that at peace. I'm at peace with my thicky. You know, it's like a turkey. I need to dress the turkey accordingly. Like I need to stuff her. She needs like some croutons, some breading, some gravy. Well, I do and I need to show what's going on without rudely panning down. He's got his Colorado Uggs, his Jeffree Star swimsuit. 3X baby. Which he wears as just casual lounge shorts. I mean, I can't talk. I've been barfing for three days. My hair is a disaster. Oh my God, this is like one of my vlogs from 2011. Um, <laughs> sorry, that was a really loud laugh, but that one just got me. Oh, I love how you got yourself. Also, I just want to address the elephant in the room. Yes, I spent all this time and money designing the room and it looks hideous because I put awful blankets here to preserve my white sofas. I thought you were going to address 
the elephant on your face, but okay. Uh, <laughs> it's nuts. Oh my gosh. Well, okay, so I need clothes. I need outfits. Like now that we're doing the podcast, I don't want to just wear the same thing in every episode. Oh my gosh, Shane has a podcast, Shane Dawson Podcast on Shane2 on YouTube. It will be listed in the link below. The first episode has gone live and it's fabulous, fantastic, a great time. I'm just wondering <laughs> if they stop saying it's my pleasure because it seemed kind of gay. <laughs> You know, it's like, dude, ain't no one else saying my pleasure, guys. Like, I'm ready. Like now that I'm comfortable with my body, like I am what I am. It is what it is. Uh, I need to figure out clothes. Do you want to see what I currently have? Maybe you can pick from there first and then we can go to the store. Yeah, of course. Okay, so there's this. Which looks good. Oh, obviously I have my fuck this shit. Fuck this shit! This <laughs> one of my favorite YouTubers ever. If you don't know who he is, Google him. I have my MTV Leopard shirt from Amazon. Shane refuses to hang up clothing. He prefers a drawer where it's messy and That's you That's not can't. true. I have my, um, my everydays hanging up. Oh. I have my white shorts. <laughs> okay. <laughs> He's never worn those. See? I oh my up, gosh. I hung up my belly and air. <laughs> okay, I've never seen you wear that. Well, belly and airs are usually quiet about it. They don't <laughs> want to be too loud, you know what I mean? Like, rich is quiet. You know? <laughs> about it. I have, um... These are clothes that he doesn't wear. Oh, I have this, which I'm never gonna get rid of it, but I do wash it and you can't tell. It's so <laughs> fucking gross. Look at that. Look at, look at that. What oh. is that? I don't know, but I love it. Oh, it smells. I washed you, it though. Uh, suddenly I'm nauseous again. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ugh. So do you see anything in here that is worth saving? <laughs> No, and what's funny is you have all of this stuff sitting here, but you literally never use it. He wears one pair of jeans, one shirt, and then he has like a switch out lounge shirt. This is honestly new for him. Like this has been I've sitting never worn this before. on display. So I thought we could take him to, what's a place where you think is somewhere you won't have a breakdown? You're saying where's a place that has thick options? Walmart. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if, I, I don't know if you want to go a, a little, let's change class, the vibe. Yeah, let's class it up a little and go, I mean, well, that's rude. I think you're okay. <laughs> I mean, I think even Walmart would be like, we get it. Let's Listen. level it up and go to Target. All my clothes when I was in school, when I was a kid, was from Walmart. Mm -hmm. And let me tell you, those clothes, not only are they big, but they soak up blood like crazy. Okay. <laughs> All right, so I guess what's the goal? Two or three looks? Should we start with one to be realistic? No, I think three looks for different occasions. I think casual look. Date night look. Date night look and podcast look. Oh, okay. Well, let me get control over this and we'll go to Target. Should I shave? Do I need to do anything with my face or my head? No. Okay. This is your Are money you maker. Sure? Not that this is. This, this isn't like a full makeover, like Princess Diaries. You're not gonna like put two <gasps> pictures of me in front of me and like. Yeah, no. Uh, well, I don't know if we could do anything drastic to your hair. I guess. Mm, I think we need to do like. Here we go. Good. Wow. I don't like whatever. That was. Well, maybe we will get like the pullouts for your outfit. We can go like we turn this and this into whoosh. a princess. Princess. I'm starting to panic now. <laughs> now, darn feel scared. Okay, he's now rocking his signature look, which is uniform. his uniform. So the goal is to find him something he actually feels comfortable in that he'll actually wear. Because I don't want you just to try something on for the video and then be like, okay, but it didn't fit me in the right places, so I'm just going to put it to the side. I'm trying to think because I've seen thicker guys dressed nicely to where you look at them and you're not like thinking about their thickness. Not that anybody should be thinking about anybody's thickness because we're all beautiful in our own ways. But like when I see Gordon Ramsay on a talk show, not Gordon Ramsay now, because now he's jacked and not a six pack. But before, like 10 years ago, I'd see Gordon Ramsay on a talk show and I'd be like, I wish I could dress like that. And I feel like we had a similar body types. Or Jamie Oliver. But I'm thinking <laughs> of chefs. Well, okay, so what do you want me to look like? Like, is there a certain like celebrity or? I want whatever you feel the most comfortable in so that we can just rock and roll throughout the world, baby. Okay, I don't want whoever that was. <laughs> I, want, I don't want that. <laughs> no, I think, are we gonna get out of your comfort zone and do something that's not black? I think, yeah, right? I think that's the point. Yeah. All right. Let's go shopping. Okay, not only are we shopping, but we're vlogging in public, which is like dual nightmares for shit. Oh, wait, what are you doing? <laughs> what do you mean? What am I doing? I don't want to vlog in public. Oh gosh. Okay, well, I'll, I'll vlog stealth mode. Like I'll be very calm and collected. Okay, I'll walk 10 feet behind you. <laughs> <laughs> Did 
they know what it's is. extra large. Stop it. Do they have to, can we get matching ones? <gasps> Well, I have to try it on first. Wow. But have you ever seen a more me thing? It's like something Katy Perry would have worn when she was doing that weird Big Brother thing where she was like trapped in a house. Oh, they have Balenciaga. What? It's like a Pico. Oh my gosh. Is it big? That's gorgeous. Oh my God, these be big. I've been sleeping on Nordstrom Rack. It might fit me. <gasps> Get ready for the breakdown. start crying. It almost has like a velvety texture. Why does it literally fit? The sleeves are like chewed, but I love it. Giving like chic anxiety. It matches my shoes. So that's just, that's part of it. <gasps> Wait, how much is it? It's not a prices, baby. Why is it so much? I thought this was so rack. Wait, you're buying it though, right? Bring yeah, yes. Wait, really? Yeah, and this that's is gorgeous cool. on you. Oh, that's so expensive. I think you have to. That's it's much. your color though. It's, it's everything. <laughs> What? You're looking for you. No, I'm looking for you too. That is not for me. You're looking for pastel short shorts for me. You're such a liar. <laughs> You're literally, you said fuck this video. You got so excited. <laughs> okay, I made him mad. <laughs> I literally, I tried this jacket on because I was like, okay, it's not black. And then he turns to me while he's looking for his own pastel shorts and he goes, the Balenciaga one's cuter. And I'm like, I'm trying to find clothes for your video. And you're fucking- No, I'm shopping for him. I really am. Well, you haven't picked out one. Okay, I here. I found those and I found the Balenciaga. And then you shamed me for this. But I'm the cameraman. No, I'm gonna shop. You just, you just watch me shop. <laughs> Hear me out. <gasps> oh, it's a matching set. Hear me out. Tucked in, romper moment. <laughs> Honestly, very Palm Springs of you, and I'm living for it. What have you found me? I found some things. Mine aren't as flamboyant as your options, but definitely not bad. I thought we were going like mood. Well, I think for the podcast, that is a look. It's something. Oh my God, did you not get me an avocado shirt? Oh. You're flopping. That wasn't. Jake, what's going on? Well, I'm not having a breakdown. <laughs> I'm definitely not having a breakdown. Maybe you want to come in here so nobody can see me? Okay. You know, it's not cute anyways. Even if it was the perfect size, it sucks. Like, Thank you. it looked better when I was just looking at it. It's only an extra large, and I know I'm a double X. I was trying new things, and it didn't work out, but I need to be more realistic about my curves. <laughs> Which, honestly, you're not even that curvy. I just think- I guess I could try the tuck in. Hold on. Oof. <laughs> Looks like I'm holding in a big old load. <laughs> <laughs> like, I need to go take a squat. Oh. Here, come over so, here to your runway. So this fits. Problem is, they don't want you to steal it, I guess. So it's connected <laughs> with a security bar thing. I look like I just broke out of a gay insane asylum. <laughs> <laughs> I look like Wendy Williams when she's like, I'm fine, I'm doing better. God, I miss Wendy. Not finished. I'm gonna get out of this. I think I need these. Well, if everything else is a fail, at least we know the Balenciaga jacket is a win. And guess what? What? It was over 50% off of this tag price. <gasps> it was meant to be. And I was like, oh my gosh, it looks so good on him. I don't even care. I'm going to buy it for him. Oh no. What? I missed the Joanne hat. Oh. Oh my god, I forgot to look for my makeup. Oh, <laughs> what a scandal. Should I do a meet and greet? <laughs> For my palette. Wait, look at the leopard luggage. Wait, I need that. I'm just gonna grab that leopard luggage and I'll be right back. You are not getting that. Why? You don't think that's everything? We should get the little one for your mom. She loves leopard as much as I do, and we should be like, surprise, you're going on a trip. Oh, <gasps> look at the fucking leopard visor. Okay, I'll be right back. Shane, oh, no. Well, you wanna go to a different store while I wrap this up? You did not. Right when I walked back in there, the guy goes, sorry, we're closed, and I said, just really, really quick, I just need to grab one thing. And he goes, okay, fine. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> I cannot go to an airport with you like that. It never ends with you. Oh, you didn't see this? <laughs> My hater blocker? <laughs> oh, you missed it? Listen, I know you don't get it, but you didn't get the corduroy couch either at first. And now it's so sickening, so iconic, literally like so bougie looking. Leopard is the next corduroy. For 40 year old women. <laughs> And listen, I love those 40 year old women. I just don't know if it's for my 30 year old husband. You know what I'm learning throughout this video? Maybe I should just stay the same. Maybe it is okay to just be me. And I just also don't want to try any more clothes because I'm starting to have a breakdown. <laughs>
Okay, now we've made it to Target and I'm trying to get more of just like a basic everyday outfit. I've never seen Shane in like a Henley like this. It's cute. Day two of shopping. It was a success and now I'm ready for Shane to try these on. Hopefully he feels stunning, gorgeous, and beautiful. I mean, I really hope that something works from all of this. And I'd be lying if I said I didn't get a few things for myself. But yeah, I was like a D to for me. Well, hey, let me set up some outfits and then we'll try everything on. Oh my gosh, I hope you're gonna feel like a beautiful, fabulous new woman. I love this angle. <laughs> Can we do the try on in this angle? Yeah, you know what, you could walk, oh my gosh. I don't know. <laughs> Okay, Chido, you're gonna rip the shirt. Hey, psst, get off. I had to go get a haircut because I had a breakdown after I saw the footage from last night. This Hello. video has very quickly turned into you getting a makeover. Well, no. <laughs> you went shopping last night and you were not looking for me. And you didn't find enough clothes, so then you had to go today. Then no, you needed the a haircut. the store's closed last night. So I so graciously went because I wanted you to have some sickening looks. I had to get a haircut because I couldn't have a crater on the side of my face and awful hair. And look at me. Who got made over in this video? <laughs> well, you're Who's about Who's Anne to. Hathaway in this situation? Oh my Not gosh. me, bitch. I'm her friend. I'm the friend who had like fucking hard spaghetti noodles in her head. <laughs> well, <laughs> you know? I've laid out three different options for you and I'm very excited. Each option has two different tops. So whichever one fits you best and that like you feel like the most confident you in is the one you should pick. This is what I hope it's like when I go to heaven. I hope God is like, okay, I have a collection of bodies over here. <laughs> Whichever top you like, you can get in. And then we'll find the right bottom. All right, look number one, here we come. That's when you're supposed to say, you're perfect just the way you are. You don't have to die to have a perfect body. Oh no, I think you're perfect as is. I didn't believe that. <laughs> Kidding. Okay. Oh, is that Gordon Ramsay? Oh my gosh. I had never seen you wear something so bright in my life. Oh my gosh, it is serving your first podcast promo photo. <laughs> oh my God. Shane. Oh my gosh. Hey, uh, you gotta, I, have no, I don't know what to say in this outfit. I feel like I'm not me. Wow. Wait, you, that's not good. That's not good. We wanted to brighten it up. We knew that we weren't serving the all black. Oh, this looks terrible. No, it doesn't. The jacket's actually oh. really cute. Shane, you don't look like yourself. That's for sure, but it's not a bad thing. It's throwing Cheeto into a tantrum. <laughs> Cheeto, no scratching the furniture. Shane. Well, okay, I, should I look at it? Yeah, let's go to the beauty room. <laughs> of course. How do you like the jeans? Well, okay. I actually don't hate the pants, how they feel, but I don't know how they look yet. I don't think I've ever worn not black pants in my whole life. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Well, I look like a church <laughs> pastor. <laughs> mm. Like, this is cute. Shane, look at it. I look like I'm dead. I look like I'm in heaven, and I don't know if I love the body I got. It's giving substitute teacher. I like that. How's the sh The shirt's cute. I like the shirt on you. God, is that what I look like? See, this is actually a bad video for me. <laughs> you probably shouldn't be doing this. I think it's cute. I like seeing you in a bright color. It's cute, Shane. Okay, I don't hate it, and that's good. Is there any piece you're gonna wear more than this time right now? Be honest. No. None? <laughs> Not even the shoes? No, definitely not the shoes. Oh my Listen, gosh. No, if we have to do like an interview, like when we're trying to have a baby and like we need to seem like normal people, I'll wear this. Or if I'm ever interviewed by Oprah, <laughs> <laughs> for some reason, never's gonna happen, but we can dream. I'll wear this. Look number two, here we come. All right. Good. This was supposed to be vacation casual. <laughs> oh no. Or podcast because it's like funky. It's a funky top for the podcast. What kind of podcast am I doing? <laughs> well, you want to like spice it up. You know, it's fun to have something funky. It looks like I'm doing a podcast for like preschoolers. <laughs> <laughs> okay, controversial opinions. Pickles are gross. Like this is. 
The joggers aren't it. I hate the shirt the least, but the outfit overall for me is even a no. It just didn't come together. Well, maybe I, okay, wait, hold on. Let me, let me try to. Okay. What are you gonna do? Can you return these? <laughs> <laughs> right? You, sh you have to return these. Oh, I feel like Ellen, like once I quit, like on vacation. You know? Just like Ellen, and she's like with Portia, and she's like, what should we do? And Portia's like, never mind. I don't want to be mean. I love you, Ellen. Yeah, this is horrible. So, okay. I kind of didn't hate the first one. This one, I want to burn. Is there, how many more? There's just one more, and this one has a few alts, but this next one is the most. Does this help? Oh, no. it's like, <laughs> makes you creepy. But isn't that what, like what dads do, like at Disneyland? No? Ew. Okay. I don't think <laughs> With so. their turkey legs? <laughs> <laughs> and they just walk around and they're like, Kathy! <laughs> okay, anyways. Okay, I failed with look number two, but look number three's come into play. Oh my gosh! This is cute for the podcast. Here, give me an intro. Hey, do you see any blue paw prints anywhere? Because <laughs> blue's been acting really weird lately. I mean, this is... No, it's cute. It's like a crushed velvet. It's Carhartt, very manly. <laughs> it's, oh, wait. Oh, I do. It, ooh, it feels like a grandma's couch. I like that. Oh, my gosh. These jeans fit you well. Wow. I'm never going to wear this. What are you talking about? This is bad. Do you like the shoes? Okay. Uh, conspiracy, what the fuck? These are not my Balenci's and they look just like them, but what are these? They're Adidas. Adidas. They ripped up Balenci? I look like Uncle Joey. Cut it out. Like that's, <laughs> whoa, oh my God, I look just like Uncle Joey. <laughs> oh my gosh, so you're not gonna wear this either. Well, I can't really tell what I look like. Cute. <laughs> Ooh, okay. Just by the vague reflection in the glass. Oh. Okay, let me see. I don't hate what this might look like like on the podcast. I might actually try this. Well, that's what I, I was, I honestly thought podcast shirt for that. How do my boobs look? <laughs> like, I feel like, is the horizontal line making my boobs look bigger? <laughs> well, when you go like this, yes, but you don't have <laughs> boobs, you have pecs. Like your pecs are actually one of your great features. Okay, give this Wait, outfit can you justice. See the lines moving? Sorry. Does it accentuate? No? No, it does. Thank you. Uh, that's all I got. I can do it with my ass too. <laughs> you don't want to see that. Wait, you can do it with my balls. Work? Yes. I can ball twerk. Get ready. I saw more clothes. I'm confused. Since you don't love this outfit, let's do the alt, the pink hoodie with the Balenci Pico. And the sunglasses or no? No, this one's serious. Like I'm oh. a date night look. Uh. Okay, and the final look. I look like if Justin Bieber ate Chris Pratt. <laughs> like, that's a visual. Take this off, although cute. I think the hoodie's another podcast moment. Like, chest up, wait, like- Wait, wait, is this better? Oh my gosh. This is a podcast look, no joke. Like, you've got to wear this on the podcast. <laughs> I look like I'm starting a gay cult. Wait a minute. That is the podcast. <laughs> Uh, wait, but what about the Lindsay, the jacket you, you got me? I think you need to put it on over a different shirt. Do you want to show what I bought for myself? I mean, I couldn't go shopping without getting myself at least one outfit. You are such a Haley. I got a whole new outfit. It looks like you changed? It looks like what you were wearing before. Oh my gosh, no, I got some new jean shorts, some brand new Adidas, and a nice comfortable top. What's on your ass? What is that? Well, I haven't taken off the tags yet. Can I see? What, what's going on? There's a lot going on. What the hell is this? <laughs> well, this comes off. How much were these? Shh. How much were these? Nobody will ever know. Oh my, it doesn't say. That's when you know it's expensive, when it doesn't even say. <laughs> no. How, did you spend more on these shorts than you did on my whole? Oh, I found it. No! Really? I could have made you those with some scissors. <laughs> no, Shane, you're forgetting that I got you this Balenciaga pea coat. I'm never gonna wear a pink hoodie my whole life. Yes, you are. I feel bad that your video's a flop, but it's, it's not is. a flop. You said that you wanted to try new things. I you did, I said. did. I, here's a problem, and I'll try this 
this disaster on in a second. <laughs> Here's the problem. You're not good at this. Oh right? my gosh! So many things. Oh my god, look at me with the halo above me. <laughs> wow, this video is really scary. If I die before this video goes up, still post it. Because it's giving like a lot of- Oh my of gosh, time. knock on glass. Definitely not a thing, but- yes, I am good not, at this! You're not good at this. This and pink one is sickening. I love you so much. You're, you suck at this. We should find like a real- Stop! Yeah. But I love you. I love you. Okay, what am I doing? Put this in the pea coat on, and then after that, we're saying goodbye. I was a winner. Cute. I look like an author of horror books. Give us a walk and a spin. Who is on high alert? Because they're gonna do something bad to themselves. <laughs> you know what I mean? I look like my wife just died. <laughs> I'm at the park and I'm like trying to find her. Well, I want to know what you guys think. If you like, <laughs> no, stop Do you it. You think Shane looks like his wife just died? <laughs> He's like needs help. No, I want to know if you liked any of the outfits. I personally think the first bright jacket was cute. The pink hoodie was everything. I like the new shoes. Look how big my rip. My oh, that's fat. Never mind. I thought that was my ribs. This it's fat. No, it's not. Let us know if you like anything. And if you think you can style yourself better than me, then why haven't you done it for 10 years? Me? Yes. I do style myself. You wear one shirt every day. That's why we did this video. And you know when I look my best? When I'm wearing that and not any of this. I love you. I love you. Okay, love well, you. not a success. Oh, oh, I know. You could return all these clothes and buy stuff for yourself. Don't act like you're not excited. <laughs> I already spent money on myself too. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'll wear some of these. I promise. I will. I will. I will. If I don't see some of this on the podcast, I'm suing. Toodles. Well, at least the outfits are Cheeto approved. You like it? You like the outfits? It's literally been 24 hours and he's still there. <laughs> Cheeto, that's my check-in. <laughs> oh. See you around when you do, we catch you.